believed a total of 24 men have arrived unexpectedly here at the Beagle Bay community, which is a small Aboriginal community on the coast about 120 kilometres north of Broome in the Kimberley region of northern WA. From what we've been told, the saga started early this morning when a local family that lives on a bush block out of town came across 21 of the men walking down a bush track surrounded by bush on both sides. They took them back to their house, gave them food, water, um, had showers and then have transported them into town. By the time the ABC arrived, um, did the drive up about two hours from Broome, the men were still seated in uh, quite a surreal scene in a public park in the community of Beagle Bay. There were locals sort of um, sticky beaking, uh, there were local police supervising the scene but there was no sign of the federal authorities. Uh, we were able to speak to one of the men with his consent he has told us that the group are made up of men from Pakistan and Bangladesh. Um, he said he intends to claim asylum, but said he could not speak on behalf of the rest of the men. There was a particularly uh, unexpected moment, however, as we were speaking with him, another uh, car pulled up uh, with a local family that lives on another block just up the coast. They had found, they told us, three other men from the same group, apparently from the same boatload um, that were found in a different location on a, another dirt track nearby. So total of 24 men we understand at the moment. After a good uh, several hours sitting um, under trees in the park, they have in the last few minutes been transported in to this uh, local primary school facility where you can see behind me the men are seated in the shade. Border force are now on the scene and it appears that they are trying to speak with the men um, one by one. We're guessing to understand the circumstances in which they've arrived in Australia. It is already the details that we've got quite a remarkable tale in terms of the men arriving on a remote beach. They're saying they walked for 35 kilometres. It's quite extreme heat at the moment. It's the wet season, so it's very humid here in the Kimberley. Um, and the uh, man that we spoke to said that he thought some of the men might die. He said they were experiencing dizziness and he was quite worried for their welfare. So still a lot of details that we do not know, but uh, the men in question all seem um, very grateful to at this point at least be given cold water um, while uh, the official processing um, process, I guess, gets underway.